Okay, 13 is a different style of movie. When I first saw it on Netflix, what really uh, spoke to me was Jason Statham, Mickey Rourke, and Curtis Jackson, or what's going on with 50 Cent. And the fact that it's about a Russian roulette tournament. And I was like, okay. I saw a trailer. It looked really interesting. What you have is you have a guy whose his dad is in the hospital. He doesn't have that much money. Bills are piling up. A guy who lives in the same building as him does some kind of shady things here, whether it's drug dealing, things of that nature. And he over here overhears him talking about some sort of larger thing going on. He then gets an envelope. The guy decides to take the envelope and go through with it. There's number 13 on the inside. He is now in this Russian roulette tournament. How do they do it? People line up in a circle. So 13 points his gun at the back of the head of 12. 14 back of the head of 13. You're getting one bullet, and it's run by Michael Shannon, which is weird having just seen Man of Steel to see him in this sort of role. You have to put your guns in the air, twirl your barrels, click. That's the end of round one. And they're betting big money on who survives these. And it's like, wow, okay. So pretty much, you're, then everyone has their own little little groups. You have the, the you, know, you almost have like a sponsor, someone who's watching the guy, and a participant. And it's like, okay. A lot of crazy people going on with this. This, this is kind of weird. Next round, two bullets in the chamber. Spin. Pop, pop. You strive to go on. So it's up being essentially like a <laughs> gun to you know, like gun to head gun to like, such a head to head duel at the end. So really super intense. And the fact that it's got a really small group of people, you know, it's like, well, why is Mickey work here? Why is Fifty Cent watching him? You get their background. Okay. Well, Jason Statham brought this guy with him. What's his background? So the major characters, you actually get a small amount of background. And it's interesting seeing somebody who had no idea what was going on and then gets thrust into a Russian roulette tournament. Very interesting movie. 